From the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, this is an ITTV special report. Our next guest manufactures GPS tracking hardware. He's a provider of GPS tracking services based on annual subscriptions. And this is a, a really a godsend for a lot of fleets around the country, companies that need to keep track of vehicles, uh, moms and dads that want to keep track of the kids, whatever the case. He's got an opportunity to help a lot of folks. President of Haas GPS. Jeff Haas. Hey, Jeff, welcome back into tomorrow. Thanks for having me on. It's always a pleasure. You guys are always doing some fun things. So what's up these days with you guys? Well, we have uh, have our normal traditional consumer line, which has stayed the same and very reasonably priced, but we've added uh, more models for our commercial line. Hmm. So now we're monitoring regular trucks. We're monitoring for refrigerated trucks. Uh, we're monitoring tire pressure on trucks or farm equipment. Wow, you really get down yes. into, like for refrigerated trucks, you're keeping we, an eye on the temperature, we have not a temperature just the vehicle sensor. itself? We have a temperature sensor in there that will tell you when it violates your preset temperature you set, mm -hmm. and it'll tell you what the temperature is. Uh, for tire pressure, you put in your tire pressure caps on each wheel. Yeah, the and, parameters. And, and there's a data logger in the car, and you just set your parameter for tire pressure. We monitor that when you get out of that range so you won't ruin an expensive tire by yeah. having it too low. Uh, we do tow trucks and trash trucks, measuring how many times an arm lifts up. So when the tow truck driver is doing side jobs, you'll know that. Oh, wow. Uh, or they're picking up extra trash uh, things at yeah. people's places. So we're monitoring all that. And our newest creation, uh, which we're in the test phase of now, is uh, we have a customer that uh, does uh, irrigation technology with an injector system. And it's an offshoot of the tire pressure system. So we're measuring water pressure and air pressure at a farm. Uh, with a uh, data modem. Jeez. And all this, of course, with your GPS technology, so you're keeping an eye on vehicles and their locations. But what a great opportunity for businesses to now really have much more insight into what's being done. I mean, I love the whole concept. Of, yeah. You know, I'm sure the drivers don't if they've got a, a take-home tow truck because they're on call and they're out, as you say, doing side jobs or something like that. It's paid for by the company. They That's need it. to know about these things. Yeah. Most of our trackers pay for themselves in the first 30 days. Oh, easily. It's, yeah. a, it's, a sad, it's a sad state that it does, but it keeps people that are trying to collect overtime well, parked sure. on the side of the road so they're on their way back to work or doing other jobs or late to jobs because they're out having breakfast on the boss's dime. And yeah. So and, and I would imagine that as far as that goes, while it may not impress the employees a lot of times, that's not the goal. The goal is so that the company can maintain its productivity so that they might even stay employed. Absolutely correct. The main thing is I look at it from a positive standpoint is to get your employees in line, make sure you know they're on their way to customers. You can let the customer know he's on the freeway, he's stuck in traffic. I try to look at it as proactively as I can. Of course, yeah. I mean, look at it from a police department standpoint. I spent many years as a cop in Miami, and when I did, they weren't doing GPS tracking. Now they are. There's a big GPS uh, device on, on every police car, and the, the concept is dispatch the closest unit to an event or something, uh, and the same thing happens with the vehicles too, delivery vehicles or what have you, you know, make the best use of your time. And of course, companies can do that with Haas GPS and be able to monitor what's going on with their vehicles, let alone setting up uh, uh, geo fences too, right? Oh, if, if something wanders out of an area, maybe your car that your son's driving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we monitor it all the time with geofence, with speed parameters, so you know how fast your son is driving. Uh-oh. You yeah. can set that speed parameter in there and, and limit it. You can put motion updates in so you know that every 10 minutes where they've been. So if you don't have time to look at it all day long, at the end of the day, you can see where they've been, how fast they've gone. Uh, but it also helps us with arrival and departures when we're supposed to go to a location. We can put in all the points of interest where an employee has to go deliver something, yeah. know when they arrive, when they left. So you've got documentation for some companies that need to have that, and it works perfect for that. I bet insurance companies are loving it, too, because you can recover these vehicles should they be stolen. Now ours, you can usually so far, we haven't had too many stolen, but you can recover them relatively quickly, so you're not worried about it. You know, yeah. you're getting your car back without a major repair. Now, tell me a little bit about Haas GPS Entertainment. That's another side of the house, I guess. But, yeah. but uh, are you entertaining us while you're keeping an eye on us? Yeah. <laughs> well, Haas GPS is an offshoot of my parent company, which is Haas Entertainment, where we've done everything for your home with home theater product. And uh -huh. so we do houses, and we'll put everything throughout your house from plasma, surround sound, 3D projector, all the fun things. We do commercial buildings. We do offices where if you want, you know, um, video conferencing so we've we've done that for 32 years and uh i made haas gps because i didn't think the industry had all the right features on 
other GPS systems that are oh, out there. Yeah. I mean, it's one thing just to keep an eye, but how right. about those reports, which are much more crucial, I think, to a lot of companies yeah. to get that critical information? Yeah, reports are critical. That's what people look at. And some companies, we, we have them print the report, and that's how they get paid off of that report that their guy was really there. Oh, good. So the reports have come into really important part of the, the factor. Well, what's next then for Haas GPS? What are you not doing that maybe slightly into tomorrow you're going to be able to add or change or otherwise enhance what's cooking? Well, we're working on this farm-type system. And we that, think would that be that irrigation the telemetry? Irrigation, <laughs> irrigation telemetry that we're working on where we can measure you know, water pressure on a farm. The customer doesn't have to send a guy out to the farm to do that. We could do it uh, via an IP address, mm-hmm. and it saves someone from driving out there, changing battery. We did a solar panel so you can it self-contain and self charge They can move it from farm to farm. Wow. So that's where we think there's a lot of opportunity, and people haven't addressed it yet. Well, check out the kinds of things that Jeff and his team are working on for you at HaasGPS.com. It's H-A-A-S. H-A-A-S GPS. Dot com. We'll link it there, too, when you hit us up at intotomorrow.com. Jeff Haas, thanks for joining us. Continued good luck. You're always doing fun things yeah. that we like talking about. I, I love I love what I do, and we're having a great time. Absolutely. Thanks Intotomorrow.com. Again. If you're not already seeing the video of Jeff's interview and all the interviews here at CES, be sure to come by, and we'll show them to you at your leisure. Intotomorrow.com. 